channel. My name is Rashonda King. For those of you who do not know me, and for today's episode, I just want to bring to you a couple of fall centerpiece ideas. Um, I've, I've created four centerpieces. I'm, I did not, I'm sorry that I don't have any footage of me creating the centerpieces, but I just want to kind of like do like a show and tell with you and explain to you like the materials that I use and, and stuff like that. And so maybe you can recreate these if you like the idea. Okay, so this here centerpiece is actually a redo. And I am going to put the picture up so you can see how it looked before. So I made the adjustment for a fall centerpiece. So this is basically a embroidery hoop. I believe I just nailed it down to like a a rectangular wood piece that I got from Home Depot. The embroidery hoop comes from Joanne Fabric. And then these flowers were given to me and these, these the leaves were given to me as well. But I believe they came from Dollar Tree. And so I just basically put a piece of foam here, did me an arrangement here. These little shiny pieces that you see here, these come from Walmart. So you can get like um, probably about eight of them for like 97 cents, I believe. And I just covered this in bling wrap because I was trying to camouflage um, this because it was like some of the golden paint was missing. Okay, so this is my hula, a hula hoop um, leaf floral arrangement with the little hanging tea light and I did put a little light in here with some little leaves so I'm just turn that on and let you see that that's how that looks okay on to another piece. this here is a floral felt centerpiece these felt pumpkins come from the Dollar Tree I have, um, I have everything sitting on a square canvas um, that was given to me. So I just wrapped the canvas in lean wrap, um, hot glued the felt pumpkins down, hot glued this felt pumpkin right here to a um, taper candle holder from the Dollar Tree to give it some height. This is a little pillar candle from Walmart and then the flowers are from Dollar Tree and they were given to me. So here is my second idea for the fall, for a fall centerpiece. My third idea is this here. I got this fancy, let me show it to you, beautiful um, glitter pumpkin from Walmart. So I didn't do the pumpkin, so the pumpkin was already made for me. But then I did go to Dollar Tree and I bought like a, a wreath and I put the flowers into the wreath. Now, if, I don't know if you can see this golden ribbon here. I pretty much just placed that in and kind of um, I could, I <laughs> folded the ribbon up and I just kind of placed the flowers in between to give it this look here. So I went with neutral colors because of the color of the pumpkin. I didn't want to do flowers that were conflict. So I went with these cream and green flowers. And the same thing with my felt pumpkin centerpiece. Because I had the white and the brown and the orange here, I wanted flowers that were complemented. So I went with these cream color flowers. Okay, and my last centerpiece, I believe I'm going to have to move the camera back so that you can see it. Okay, hold on while I adjust the camera. Okay, so I have this large hula hoop centerpiece. The hula hoop comes from the Dollar Tree and all of the flowers are from Dollar Tree. And these little um, glitter pumpkins and gourds here, I believe that's what you call them. They are from Walmart, so like I got a pack of eight of them. So I just pretty much used some little um, skewers and I stuck them into the foam and I 
stuck these right on top. So I just got like a little, a small piece of foam. The less foam you use, the less floral you have to use. So I did try to make sure I didn't put too much foam here because then I would have had to try to cover it. And then up here, I just got me some crystals hanging. I kind of ran out of the flowers, so that's why I was only able to put one here. I probably would have put a little bit more up here, but I ended up putting the leaf, the leaves up here because they do coordinate with the reddish, um, burnt orange color that you see down here in the arrangement. So, um, like I said, this is a recreate. So I have like I have recreated this. This is like the third thing I have created from this, and I would definitely post the pictures to let you see what this was before, what it was the first time, what it was the second time, and of course you see what it is now. So this is a centerpiece that I just recreated. So these are my four centerpieces. this the felt pumpkin candle centerpiece that doesn't matter what you call it but just let me know which one you like the best um i guess this one can be called our uh, the pumpkin reef centerpiece and this one i would say this is like a hula hoop bling centerpiece Okay, so comment below, let me know what you think of these centerpieces, which one you like the best, and um, feel free to share my video with someone that has like a fall event coming up, or I can definitely see these being used um, at home on, like, on the dinner table. And then, also don't forget to like it. And if you haven't had the chance to subscribe to my channel, please do so. If you missed anything, if you want to know any details about these pieces, please feel free to leave any questions. Okay, until I see you next time. Bye.